Hello, my name is Ryan Irvin and I'm a Territory Account Manager for Erie Tech. And today I wanted to show you how to measure shivs with shiv gauges and which will help you determine if your shivs need replaced um, when you're replacing V-belts on a belt drive. So this is a set of shiv gauges. Um, I recommend that every one of my customers has one of these at their plant and readily available. The way these are used is each gauge is determined by the outside diameter of your shiv, okay? And each one of these is labeled for either A, B, C, 3V, 5V, or 8V shivs. And that's how you determine what gauge to use on what shiv. Over the past years, through my experience with Erie Tech, over the past 17 years, I've noticed that um, a lot of times I'll have customers that keep repetitively buying the same belts over and over again. Um, that's a red flag to me. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll talk to my customers and say, hey, why are you guys buying so many belts? The normal answer I get is, you know, it's just the operations, it's what we do, we replace these belts every so often. What I do is I tell them, hey, next time you replace your belts, use these shiv gauges, put them on your shiv, and see if your shiv needs replaced, and that way you'll get the maximum life out of your belts, okay? So let me show you how these work, okay? What I have here is two belt shivs. Um, one is for B belts, B like boy, and one is for 3V belts okay so this shiv here with the b belts is a newer shiv so i'm going to measure that and see um, if that shiv is still good for operation this one here is a 3v that has been used a while i have a shiv gay for a 3v belt so i'm going to measure that as well and see if this would still be good for operation okay so with the b belt the way these shivs work and they come like this okay um, and if you ever need any of these, just let us know and we'll deliver them to you. This is how these work, okay? So you find the, these are all labeled, okay? This one is labeled for B-belts. So what you do is you take this gauge, um, you put the, the gauge into the wedge of the, of the shiv, okay? Point it up to the, to the sky or to a light. And what you're looking for is any light seepage through the edge of the shiv and the edge of this gauge, okay? So when I do this, I can see that there is no light penetrating through the gauges. So that tells me that this shiv is good for operation and doesn't need to be replaced. This is a 3V shiv that has been used quite a bit. Um, I have my 3V gauge right here. So I'm gonna do the same process. Point it to the light, look at it. Now I can see here, that there is a lot of light coming through this gauge. And as you can see, this shiv is like shark teeth, okay? So this shiv needs replaced, okay? And anytime you replace your belts and you don't check the shivs, you're gonna have a lot of problems with your belts. Your belts aren't gonna get the life that you, that you expect from them, and this shiv is just gonna eat them up. Industry standard recommends that you replace shivs every third time you replace your V-belts, okay? But we recommend to check the shivs on every belt replacement because you never know through operation how hard the application is if, um, if your shivs are being worn out, you know, on the first go around. So we always recommend checking the shivs before you replace your belts. Thank you very much for taking the time to listen to me and have a great day.